Welcome to Learn Yourself. Try this sums, page number 90, second numerical. There are two types of boxes containing mangoes. Each box of larger type contains four more mangoes than the number of mangoes contained in eight boxes of the smaller type. Now let us first understand the question and try to write equation for that. So there are two types of boxes. Small boxes are there and larger boxes are there. Now, these two types of boxes, now what they are saying, each box of larger type, so they are talking about this, contains four more mangoes. So, there are four more mangoes in this kind of boxes, bigger boxes. Then the mangoes contain in eight boxes of smaller types. Here they have already said that smaller boxes are eight in number. And here, the larger boxes are having four more mangoes than these eight boxes. They have given us a mixed information for both the boxes. Each larger box contains 100 mangoes. Now, these are larger box. So, larger box, each box has 100 mangoes. So, we know that each box has 100 mangoes. Within this 100 mangoes, 4 mangoes are more compared to the smaller boxes. And how many number of smaller boxes are there? 8 number of smaller boxes are there. Now, this is all about our information. That all this information have been given to us. Now, from this we have to frame an equation. So, what do we have to find out here? Find the number of mangoes contained in smaller box. So, for one, so in one smaller box, how many mangoes are there that we have to count? So, this we have to find out. This is our question. That quantity of mango in smaller box, in one smaller box, that we have to find out. So, let us guess this number as x because that we have to find out. Now, with this x and this information, let us frame an equation. So, we already have x. That x number of mangoes are there in one box. In one box. Now, one smaller box has x number of mangoes. Now, how many smaller boxes are there? 8 smaller boxes are there. So, here I am going to multiply with 8. So, this is the quantities of mangoes in all the smaller boxes. Now, what all things are remaining? One larger box, 4 more mangoes are there. And each box has 100 mangoes. So, we have total quantity that 100 mangoes are there. But that is in larger box. So, if this quantity represents for the larger box and this solution is for larger box that in each larger box 100 mangoes are there, then we have to make this equation for larger box. So, in larger box, 4 mangoes are more as they said. So, this is the quantity of smaller box and each larger box has 4 more mangoes. And how many total mangoes are there in each larger box? 100. So, that is how we can write the equation from this, from this pieces of information. That 8x, that represents the total mangoes in smaller box. Plus 4. Why have we have written here plus 4? Because solution that is 100, that total mangoes represents in larger boxes. So, here we have to make this solution for larger boxes. Now, in larger box, 4 mangoes are more compared to smaller boxes. So, I have added here 4. Now, this is my equation and from this I am going to find out the x. Once I will find out the x, I will get the quantities of mango in one smaller box. So, let us find out the x. So, our equation here is 8x plus 4 equals to 100. Now, we have to separate this variable which is 
in addition with 4. So first we are subtracting with 4 towards both the side. We will get here 8x plus 4 minus 4 equals to 100 minus 4. So this 4 and this 4 will get cancelled out. We will get 8x equals to 100 minus 4. We will get 96. Now 8 is in multiplication with x. So if we want to separate this x, we have to divide with 8 towards both the side. So here we will get 8x divided by 8 towards RHS and same way we are dividing with 8. So 96 divided by 8. So 8 and 8 will get cancelled out and here we will get 12 8s are 96. So x equals to 12 we got as a solution. Now what is our x? x is number of mangoes. That number of mangoes contained in smaller box. So in smaller box 12 mangoes are there. So thank you for watching and learning with us. If you have any doubt please comment down below. I'll see you in next video. Till then, keep learning, keep sharing. And don't forget to subscribe, learn yourself.